What's going on friends? We're here at ECC in Ontario and I'm at the Sheridan with Demo Vapes and I was wondering why the heck he chose this hotel. Well, it turns out I figured it out with a little walk outside. Demo's still asleep by the way. He's uh, it's one of those guys. So, he likes to sleep late and I'm like up and about doing things. So I look out the hotel window and uh, turns out, yeah, there's an In-N-Out burger right within walking distance. What the hell is that about? Demo, I figured you out, bro, I figured you out. So I'm gonna walk over there and check it out. My name's Stan, and you have found the Tenacious TX Vapes channel. <sighs> So when you're in California, you're supposed to do like the Californians do, supposedly. Everybody tells me, you gotta get in and out burger. You gotta, you gotta get in and out burger. So I am uh, eating in and out burger. Now I've had it before, been to California a few times in my life. I enjoy California. I enjoy in and out burger. It's not my favorite. But, it's pretty delicious. And for breakfast, 9.30 or 10 o'clock, whatever time it is in the morning, a double-double animal style is pretty damn good. Look who's up. Demo. What'd you eat for breakfast, Demo? Oy. I ate two double-doubles. Two double-doubles. Stan walks in with a double-double animal style and a regular double-double, and I was like, Oh, dude, he's like, he's like, yeah, yeah, go ahead and eat. And I was thinking, well, you know, pick one, right? And so I picked my animal style one, and I like asked Stan, I was like, well, so are you gonna save this for for some other time? And he goes, no, bro, I just, I just got an extra one. You have the second one. I was like sitting in bed. I was like, well, I mean, okay. That's the kind of service you get whenever you room with Stan. You room with Stan. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to hit up ECC. We're gonna. What we have? We're, we're going to meet up. We're going to meet up with Nick Bissett, Nick Bissett Daily Vape TV. and Brett Langford of the Cloudy Vapor, right? Yep. And we're going to have some coffee, maybe, and... Center ourselves. Ce center our chi. Our chi our must be centered. Our must be aligned. Get over being angry <laughs> that we've been told we can't take backpacks at the ECC. Yeah, it's bullshit. So we're getting over all that business, and then we are going to rock our way to ECC and start our day. You're coming along. Oh, I got something cool to show you too. Guess what's happening? You might get to see Demos Ferrari finally. Boy. Finally, after screwing around for so long, you know, this and that and that and this, we are heading to the car. And uh, guess what? Demo brought his Ferrari. A Ferrari. His Ferrari. And I feel so, uh, so, What's the word I'm looking for? No. Lucky, I guess, Lucky? is the word. Because I get a ride in the Ferrari. This is the last week you're going to have yeah. it. How do you feel about that, bro? Uh, I'm, I'm going to miss it, man. You're, you're going to miss it? I'm going to miss it. Well, you know what? You guys get to see it. Here we go. Ta da. Look, guys, it's legit. It's for real. Give us a pose, Demo. A pose on the car. Oh, snap.
We're here at the Me One Move. Check it out. I found Buffalo Juice Girl. There she is. What? Shout your Instagram out. At Buffalo Juice Girl. At Buffalo Juice Girl. It's that easy. Check her out. She's awesome. She's got an awesome feed. Boom. So we're standing out in front of Squadland. Squadland. We got Yoshi and Ruby hanging. There's there's Josh. He's famous. Did you know him? No? Yeah, dude, you totally are. A little bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> Check out Tyler. Vapor Gate. Action. There's Demo sticking his camera in everyone's face. <laughs> oh, excuse me, and you're not? What? And you're not doing that? That's literally not a camera. This is literally not a camera. camera. This is a, a selfie rig. Demo! <laughs> Kiss me, Cobain, roaming around the dinner lady booth. There's Demo doing some weird uh, Instagram live stuff. There you go. This is Johnny. Johnny Five. Blow some clouds, y'all. Johnny Five. Ah, uh, who you repping today? Purple Kids V2. Uh, broadside. 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 Good mod. Is it as good as the Dreamer? I'm gonna put you on the spot. Ah! I'll play the fifth. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, thanks for meeting up with me. You guys go check out Kismet underscore Cobain on Instagram, all right? What hey. about you, man? What's your what's your vaping underscore JG? Vaping underscore JG for freaking Johnny Five right here. Hey, hey bro, good to see you, man. Today's is absolutely good Kismet approved. Uh, hashtag Kismet approved. Check them out, y'all. I got Eric Squid Industries right here. Say what's up, Eric? What's up? Hey man, you want to talk about anything new coming out? Uh, uh, or what's happening with Squid Industries? I mean, everything's happened with Squid Industries this year. We have, uh, so right now we're running shots, juice line, cocktail theme, uh, really good flavors. We've hit every palette with this juice line. So nice. you've got real sweet, fruity, uh, all the way down to like savory, you know, kind of pretty. Yeah, so. I'm about, I'm about to try them all right now. Of course, we've been running the Double Barrel 2.1. Uh, third version of the double barrel we continue to refine it we've got just a killer killer product right here he's uh, not exaggerating coming out in the next uh, week or two we're gonna be dropping the TAC 21 so that's a uh, dual 21 700 battery 21 700 it takes 2700 and 18650 with the sleeve so you've got a ton of options with this thing 200 watt all the functionality of the double barrel yeah um, but bigger battery, more power. So very, yeah, very yeah. Cool. The other cool thing we added to the Tax 21 is a bypass mode. So, uh, oh, nice. Right. So we can actually run nice series unregulated, but it still has all right. the safety features of a regulated mod. So you don't That's have to worry badass. about blowing your face off. That's badass, dude. Yeah. I'm super stoked on the new stuff Squid Industries is doing, man. I appreciate you talking to me. And, well, thank dude, you, brother. That's freaking yeah, awesome. Yeah. That's freaking I, awesome. Ah! So here's the thing. Demo, Nick Bassett, and me have all agreed to do a random juice tasting. We're each gonna choose for each of each other. I get Nick, Demo gets me, and Nick gets Demo. So Nick has chosen that Demo's gonna try Yogi. All right, so what is this? It's a blueberry granola. Demo, what'd you think about it? I thought it was good. Yeah, now that we're away from the booth, I thought it was good. I thought the blueberry is good. The honey tasted like uh, dirty, so like you know, like how sometimes the honey could like smell like dirty socks. 
It kind of had that. It did. It had the yeah. It had that a little bit for me. <laughs> so you know, there's that. But like oh, peanut butter banana. Peanut butter banana was interesting. It was different. It was good. But it was so it was none good. that you really blew you away. So the blueberry was actually really good. Blueberry. Blueberry is my favorite. It actually had like a nice natural blueberry flavor. So. Did you get any granola out of it? Yeah, no, I, I genuinely did. I genuinely did. There was like a, a, a nice. It tasted like granola. Look at her! Look at her! Look at her! They started playing. It's just <laughs> <laughs> What's going on guys? Check it out. This is hey. Lena with Fix. Hey. Man, I tried a Fix for the first time last night and I came here directly so that I can get one because I need a Fix. Tell us what's coming out new. What, what are we doing new here with uh, Fix? So Fix, we're releasing five new flavors, but the first two that's coming out is a blue raspberry and a cold grape. But the other three, you just gotta wait and stay tuned to find out. What a tease! Sorry, sorry, I can't tell you all. That's tease. all I can tell you. I got so you two. So blue raspberry two. and a grape? Yes, uh, a blue raspberry and a cool grape. A cool grape. Oh no! <laughs> oh, I got that. I got that. I got that. Boom! Stay you guys check more. out the fix. Stay tuned for more. What's going on, guys? I got Josh with Geek Vape slash Digi Flavor. Hey, man, check it out. What do you got coming up new? Got a lot of things coming up new. First up is the Themis RTA. The Themis RTA. Themis RTA is Here's kind of a, a different take on the Zeus. It has, right. the, has the top airflow. Uh, you can actually get it in two different versions. Okay. A dual coil version or a mesh version. So you Not can, interchangeable, just two the, versions? They are interchangeable. I do believe that they are actually going to release the decks separately as well. So okay. you'll be able to purchase the decks so you can switch between mesh and regular coils at your convenience. Mesh and regular coils, two different decks. Sweet, the the thermos? Themis. Themis, the Themis, oops. This is the blade kit. Yeah. The blade kit goes up to 234 watts. Show it off. Uses, let me get this off. Uh, this one. Okay, so 18650s. Uh-huh. Or, pull out the adapter. 2700 to 2700. 2700 and 2700s with the new blade kit. What was that? Blade kit? Blade kit. Those blade kit. 234 watts. It's made of uh, aircraft aluminum, so it's extremely light if you'd like to feel it. Yeah. It's extremely light. Most of the, the weight's in the tank. Wow, the weight is in the. Here, take the tank. I'm making him work. Man, that is super, super light. All the weight's gonna be in the batteries. It feels, is that painted? So it's, it's a uh, resin material. It's actually waterproof. A waterproof resin cast, right? Very, very cool, very, very cool. I'm gonna have to pick one of those up for review. Boom, is that it? Uh, that is about it. All right, guys, you heard it here first. We got some Geek Faith and Digi Flavor. Showed you two awesome products coming out. Keep an eye out. Red apple. A lot of red apple. Yep. The kiwi kind of 
it kind of smooths it out at the end. That's nice. I like that. Man, I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to, I think I'm going to get a bottle of that. Awesome. Then my personal favorite, the water dragon. Water dragon. Uh-oh. Maybe I spoke too soon. Water dragon. Yeah. We'll see. I don't think I've what is that the tank? That's the Spire Revo tank. The Spire Revo tank is magnetic? No. The, that's a quick release adapter. I don't know who we got those from, though. Dude. That's, that is a trip. Look. I'm, I'm like, oh, I don't want that flavor. I want this flavor. What just happened? You can literally see my head explode. Water dragon. Watermelon dragon fruit. Watermelon dragon fruit. That's good too. Let me try that. I haven't even tried that. No. <laughs> I like that one, but I still think the kiwi apple is my favorite. Awesome. One, one more. more. Peach. Peach has always been a little overwhelming for me. Just a little bit? Yeah, so we'll see what happens. That's not that's not overwhelming at all. Alright. All the flavors have been really, really candy, really sweet, but the peach is like toned down. It surprised me, and they take it out. Uh, and that's usually is a little overwhelming. Peach is usually a little crazy overwhelming, and they take it out. So that's pretty good. Awesome. Uh, dude, you guys did a good job with that. Awesome. awesome. Thank I like you. that. I like that a lot. So, um, what kind of what kind of special are we running? I need to pick some up right now. I need to pick some of this up. Shout your Instagram out, whatever it is, or what, uh, whatever you want to shout out. Find me at uh, ray.roundseliquid. Ray.roundseliquid. Guys, I ran into Corey and Katie, Arsenal Mods. Arsenal Mods on Instagram. You should check them out. Show them what, uh, show them what we're talking about here. Boom, check that out. Look at that. Look at that crazy venting on these things. Woo! What do you got new coming out, or what are you redoing? What, what's coming up that uh, big for Arsenal mods? Uh, we've got bigger batteries, different style tubes, different decks. So more things are coming. More every, things every are way. coming. More yep. things are coming. Thankfully. It's a true hybrid RDA, so there's no 510 on here. Boom! Arsenal mods RDA is pure hybrid. Extremely thick wall, it's a solid piece, so there's no threading in the middle. So it's one solid piece, and when you buy the kit, it comes with the short tube as well. Very cool. They offer the solid colors, can they special order the Cerakotes? Custom, custom orders we mainly do on Instagram. Solid colors are available through Midwest Distribution for stores, or through us directly on Instagram, Facebook website however so if you guys want to check out arsenal mods go check them out on instagram arsenal mods all one word and then if you're interested in buying one you want a custom seracote i mean look at this look at this seracoting look at this thing look at it look at it it's freaking amazing look at those vents so hit them up on arsenal mods and he can custom do it for you look guys i found DJ LSB Vapes, second time he's been on my channel. I feel like uh, I feel like I'm luckiest guy ever. Like, look at this dude. Look at this dude. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> We're talking about camera issues. Yes. What's What's your favorite part of your new camera or of that uh, camera? There's even anything that I like on the camera. No, I, I'm kidding. <laughs> he hates his camera. I'm kidding. <laughs> no, no. My issue with cameras is, is that you you gotta own every single different camera for different usages, right? Like. This is my second here. My right. Backup. It's like, like for instance, is you have the, the closest competitor to this one is the Sony Alpha 6500. That one has amazing autofocus, but it overheats and it has a 30 minutes cut out when you're recording 4K 60 FPS. Right. That. This one records 4K 60 FPS. It doesn't overheat. It doesn't. It barely heats. But then it has an, a terrible autofocus. Right. Then who yeah. the hell? thought on building the ports that we use to get the video out of the camera that get in the way when you flip the screen. It's like, <laughs> what the hell? Design, right? designers, who thought, who thought this stuff up? So, yeah. This whole thing is a money grabber, basically. Really? You, gotta, you buy one camera, but then you have issues with that camera, or it doesn't do well some things, and then you end up buying a second camera. So it's a money grabber. So are you going to replace it? 
No. No? No. Just gonna do it. Just gonna deal with it. Gonna deal with it. They're expensive. Yeah. And we usually say on devices that cost 30, 40 dollars that have minor issues, we complain so much, right? People that use these things spend eight hundred thousand dollars on them. They spend two thousand, three thousand, four thousand dollars, and they say they specifically say on their videos that they just, they just learn to deal like they just deal with the issues. You have to for three thousand, four thousand dollars, really? <laughs> <laughs> well, you can't afford to change it, you know, yeah. so easily, dude. What do you got in your hand right there? The the, the baby nest. The baby nest. Woo. Really digging these guys. 2700? Yes. Uh, no, 21700 inside, but it, it fits 18652. And it has, when you turn it on, it actually has a selection for 18650 or 21700 to give you more power with 21700. But really ergonomic device in the Zenith. The Zenith, oh yeah, nice. Some mouth to lung action. That lasts all damn day, I bet. With probably the best tobacco liquid I ever found. And they are here. Don Criso, yeah, Don. Oh, there you go. Don Criso, probably the best tobacco liquid out there. Nice, man. Yeah. Well, thanks, dude. Here, you're welcome. I got, I got stuff in my hands. Yep. See, this is what we have to do. Ah. <laughs> All right, guys. Here we go. I'm picking Mama San for Nick. Daily Babe TV. He's gonna try it out. He's only tried one of their flavors a long time ago, so it's pretty much fresh. All right. Here. What do we got here? Alrighty, we got Filipino ube style cheesecake. Um, your partner there was telling me that uh, ube is like a purple yam. It is a candied yam, yes. A what? Candied yam. Candied a yam. purple candied yam. Purple candied yam. It's delicious. Delicious. It's sweet but not too sweet. It has a nice like buttery base to it. And you get a little of that graham crackery kind of crust. Yes. Yeah. The notes one out of the ladies is the melon creme, honeydew melon. Honeydew melon? This is probably my favorite. I, I love a honeydew melon. I mean, I'm a big fan, so. I love melon. A lot of meat. Excellent balance. It's like a sweet honeydew. Yes. It's pretty, pretty basic flavor, but what more can you ask for with a honeydew? Or, exactly. Next up, our guava pop. Guava and peach infusion. Oh, I love guava. Our and candy, I, my personal top favorite. Now, now, I must warn you, I am a harsh critic of peach flavors because peach is one of my all-time favorite flavor profiles. Excellent. One more rip. It's a very good mix. Like, you can't pick one flavor on the inhale, one flavor on the exhale. It's just kind of like nice guava peach. Yeah, it's just kind of one flavor melts together really nice. Oh, wow. Those two flavors just are so good together. Did you say the guava pops? <laughs> it pops. Next up? Next up is mango lychee. This is Bruce lychee. Okay. Bruce, Bruce lychee. lychee. Love it. I love the name. Here, show I know, I'm not showing the bottles That's either. Okay. Lychee is a really tough flavor. Yes, it is. It's a really tough flavor. It's well executed. It's definitely not too sweet. I'm not a huge Very fan, I'll be honest. Taste. Right. I'm not a huge fan of lychee to begin with, but this is good. It's a good mix. It's not too sweet. It's not too overdone. So, yeah, you get, you get points for that, although it's not my favorite flavor profile. What's the, what's the verdict out of the uh, overall verdict, the I, whole line? I have a new favorite. Really? Uh, yeah, the uh, peach. Guava peach. Guava peach is amazing. What's up? yourself out. We're going over at the Mama San booth. Check this out, ECC 2018. ECC 2018. They've done a little rework on the, the guava pop. Um, I enjoy, I, well, I'm about to try the rework, but it's my favorite flavor, so we're gonna see if we it's any good. I'll let you know if it's not, but if I don't say anything, it's awesome. Nick's new favorite, he's loving it. Boom, check out Mama San. All right, guys. Exactly. Say what's up. There you go. Oh, what's up? crap. We're just getting into a political. Uh, that's why I said. Right. That's why I interrupted you. So and now we I do want to hear what Daniel like... has to say, though. I do actually. No, we think that most of the things. Rude and Tootin. Rude and Tootin do it again. Fresh Bill that's Friday. The, that's that's for you, really Dwayne. On real life. That's very true. Right? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh boy. That's very good perspective. <laughs> <laughs> He's saying it. What's up, DJ? What's up? Oh, there they are. I saw it. I saw it. Wait, what'd you eat? What's going on? <laughs> Went to Taco Hut, yeah, got of, some carne asada. <laughs> <laughs> no, 
Oh, yeah, game over for this guy. I'm gonna freaking interview kid with him, man. Say what's up, dude. What's going on, guys? What's up, dude? Yeah, ECCAP. Shout out your channel, bro. Sherlock Holmes, Instagram Sherlock Holmes. Yeah, come check me out. <laughs> dude, uh, what happened here? What is this business? You guys just like show up with. With beer and we're juice? We're like the juice. No beer, just juice. No beer, just juice. Okay, then you can have I'm some of mine. Juice for beer. You're trading <laughs> juice for beer. That sounds like a fair trade to me, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited like this guy is right now. He's so excited. Dude, every time, man. You get him throw up. Dude, it's flicked off the whole UK. <laughs> Alright, guys, so day two of ECC has come to a close. I'm gonna sit here, do a little vaping, some friends, drink a little cervezas. Uh, I'll bring back more fun stuff tomorrow. Sorry I didn't get any video of day one. My flight, I was ridiculous. I sat eight, eight hours with airport stuff. Drove me insane. So, see you in the morning. Wow. Boom! Day three, y'all. It is day three, ECC Expo. Me, Demo Vapes, Demo Vapes, Nick from Daily Vape TV, Brett from the Cloudy Vapor, I was Sherlock, Ho Sherlock Holmes yesterday, Holmes, H-O-H-M-S, go check him out, whoa, there's a blimp outside, we did a live show with him yesterday, it was a lot of fun, if you want to see, oh, what's up, man, what's up, Rico, I just wanted to do the thing that I normally do and show you guys a little bit about kind of cool stuff I picked up, the deals are crazy, the people are fantastic, uh, the show is kind of, the show is good, the show is a lot of fun, however, they're pissing us all off by not letting us take our backpacks in. What the heck, ECC? Not cool. And that's gotta for sure, like, make vendors mad and stuff, I don't know. I'd be really interested to find out what people's thoughts are on ECC, um, after all this happens. The story of ECC seems to be mouth to lung. I mean, every booth you go by, everybody's got their own pod system. Fix has a huge booth here, and you know what? I tried to fix for the first time Friday night. Demo Vapes is like, dude, you gotta try this. I took a puff, and I was like, immediately hooked. I've tried a lot of pod systems. I enjoy a lot of pod systems. I went out the next day and bought a fix with the melon pods. Uh, what are these, cool melon? Oh my gosh, y'all. There's Demo right there. What's up, Demo? Bye! We're fixing it. We're fixing it up today, dude. Dude, I, look at how slick this hat is, man. I'm totally rocking this today. I don't care. I don't even care. I like it. It matches my shirt nice, and uh, yeah, dude. Also, Mr. Grim Green himself. Got to hang out with him a little bit. Um, Ruby Roo, uh, Twisted Messes, Kent, Dwayne, own boy OC, um, Tony B of the Vapor Trail channel. Daniel, DJ, LSB, Babes. I mean, they're all here. They're all cool. Jess Marie. Um, am I forgetting anybody? J-Bo. M-Turk. -Turk. Dude. Coil Turd. Coil Turd. All these guys are Dude. here. They're all cool people. It's, it's been, been lit. It's been cool as hell to like yeah. meet these people and hang out and stuff. Boom. Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. Squid Industries is here. Got to talk to Eric from Squid Industries. I'm sure you guys have probably already seen that footage or maybe you'll see it after this. I don't know yet. I haven't done any editing, but... I already have one, but I picked up the second version with the screen and in this badass champagne color. Man, talk about a, and you know what? Killer deals going on. Killer deals. If you guys want to pick stuff like that up, you got to check the shows out, man. Got to, right, Demo? Right. Boom. Oh, I got something else. I can't show you what it is. Ha ha ha. Teaser. I'm not allowed to. They told me no. Um, it is an RDA, but that's fine. It is an RDA. Why you got it? Dude, that's too much. Too much information. Dude, that's, that's, I got an RDA. A product category. <laughs> I got an RDA that I'm not allowed to tell you about. Isn't that cool? I feel so special. Dude, I got I to gotta hang. Uh, well, dude, we hung out with Ilea and James of Wake Mod Co. I went by their booth and I picked up because they're so cool. I was like, I want to buy one of their little foot kits because I've heard good stuff about it and I wanted to support them. Dude, check out that ride outside. That's an old Plymouth. But uh, anyway, Wake Modco, and I got the, oh, let me get it out, let me get it out. Oh, oh snap. All right, they've got their new white versions out now, and I know you guys have probably watched Demo Vape's review on the Littlefoot kit. He had the black and probably. gold. Probably. <laughs> black and gold? I had the black and gold, yeah. Black and gold, but check this out. 
Wow. Dude, I want that white and blue so bad. Dude, they had white and green, white and red, white and black. Like, they had all the colors with white panels. And it's just, oh, oh, it's just so clean. It is. And not only. Sick as tits. Sick as tits. And hopefully it hits like a truck full of <laughs> fake male appendages. Truck full of plastic penises. <laughs> it's got the, the weight tank on top. Yep, it came with a 1.2 ohm coil and a 0.6 ohm coil, 1. I think. 1.5 and a 0.5. Okay, well, Demo correct me, and he's correct, I'm sure. There's a lot of bad information floating around out there. Dude! Well, not you. Uh, dude, you, you come on my show and tell people, like, bad information? No, 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 You're no. You're fired, Demo. <laughs> but can I still ride in your Ferrari? No. Oh, that's, that's no. shit. <laughs> Jess Marie hooked me up with some DHD double helix designs funk to put on top. I love this drip tip. I think it just makes this setup look so, I mean, you guys know me. Look at these colors. It's just so much funk happening right here. And uh, this thing is so tiny and awesome. I can't, I'm not setting it up today, but I can't wait to set it up. Boom. I told you guys in the testing, I was buying that rounds and I did. I bought that rounds. Dude, 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 dude. Dinner lady. Yes, please. Thank you very much. And when I get home, this lemon is probably going to be confiscated by my wife and I'll never see it again. So I'm going to have to open it before I get there. Let's hit up day three. What do you say, Demo? Yeah. You, you, you're super excited, bro. Yeah? Tremendously excited. I need to go put things on Twitter. I'm tremendously excited. It's going to be epic. It's going to be the most bigly day that we've had so far. I'm just going to keep winning. You're going to get so sick of us winning, because we're just going to keep winning. And that's what we're going to do today. Demo. What? What are we doing right now? Walking to my car. Walking to, we got to walk to the Ferrari because to drive us drive to the show. Because I was a responsible individual. Good job, Demo. Didn't drive. Don't was... drink and drive. Yeah. You know what? I got a question for you. What? Why did it smell like cow manure when we walked out of the hotel? I don't know. I'm very uh, I'm curious about that. That's a very strong stench happening right now. Hey guys, check it out. I got Rodman and Pablo from Vape Radio, yeah. VapeRadio.com. What do you guys got going on coming up and new stuff and what's happening? Give us oh, a what do we got? We got DJ Q-Ball from the Bloodhound Gang does our Saturday Night Mix show, The Bridge. You want to check that out? Oh, and don't tell them about Kate with oh, yeah. Ohms and Amps. Ohms and Amps every Saturday, uh, 10 a.m. Central Time, 6 p.m. Sunday nights uh, Central. It's a great show. Eclectic mix of juice and eclectic mix of music. Yeah, Vape Radio is really cool. You can find it at VapeRadio.com. You can get the uh, app on the Android devices. Apple sucks because they hate vape so they won't let her app on there but you can browse to vaporadio.com check it out there and I do I will say this though the morning show that's on from 9 to 12 not that great but Scotty at night is really really He's good really good and this so, guy here we yeah. love him oh 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 thank you so much I'm, I'm waiting on it that no. beard <laughs> I just wanna let you hey I okay yeah okay no I hey. love vape radio I listen to it daily you guys should check it out stream it online vaporadio.com vape, vape gets weird baby Sometimes. We got clean pills, Alan Arjad at clean pills today, pre made coils, all the good stuff. Follow us on Instagram. Yo, but that's it. Right, we got Black Box right here. We just released an ECC. Come to your next, uh, I don't know, babe shop local, anywhere. All day. That shit's loud! Hey guys, check it out. We're right here, Squadland back there, and I got Ruby Roo. What's up, Ruby? Hey, it was awesome to get to meet you the other night. We got to go down by the squad house and check them out, say what's up. Um, Ruby and all the guys have been really, really cool. Uh, she decided, she said, hey, we, I can come on and do some questions with you or whatever. Yeah. So uh, do you have anything new coming up? Anything that nobody knows about or yeah, that I is do. okay to talk about? Or? Not super a lot. Yeah? Uh, yeah. Uh, my husband and I are working on I, uh, a box mod right now. Oh. And we're hoping to launch in April. So stay. April launch and Josh is cool as hell so you guys should support him too very cool very very cool how about like what's your favorite part of ECC this year oh you know my favorite part of ECC every year is just hanging out with my friends meeting new people hanging out with new friends like I love it it's oh thank fun. you so yeah, much just the crowd the industry like getting to see my my people 
keep so I don't get to see all the time and meeting new friends. So yeah. that's what I love about it. I love the community aspect. So. That, do you know what? That is the exact way, same way I feel. Yeah. The community thing comes first before even the show thing. Like I love yeah. going around and asking people about new stuff and yeah. asking people about it's like. It's cool to see like new products and new launches and all that, but. Like my favorite favorite is just to see my friends. The connection. And meet, yeah, and to meet new people. I think it's great. Yeah, it's fantastic. And you guys have an awesome booth. It's been this, so busy. This is the most busy booth in the whole place. Probably, yeah. 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 How does that feel? Is it a little like make you a little anxious or it's a lot. We're gonna need a bigger booth. <laughs> like, I don't know how to jaws flash yeah, back. We're going. Gonna need a bigger yeah, next year I think we're gonna have a much bigger booth. Very cool. Yeah. Well, I know you guys know who Ruby Roo is. I know you guys already subscribed to her, but if you don't watch, or, or I'm sorry, if you don't listen to Culture of Clouds, you need to go check that out yeah, and leave a five star ratings. Fantastic podcast. I love it. And I know you guys probably know about that too, but I feel like I need to promote her somehow, even though she doesn't need it. <laughs> oh, so. oh, great, man. Oh, it's always good. It's always good. Thank you so much. I found I found Tony B. Of course you're gonna find me. Alright, right, dude, you know what, man? This guy is crazy and pretty cool. So I wanted to talk to him a little bit about something I found. The Pulse, he was carrying this around the other That's night. Right. The Pulse BF 80 watt box mod with G. Dude, is there enough room on that mod for this name? There isn't. There isn't? So we're just gonna call it the Pulse 80. That's what we're gonna say. You know, I mean, cool, actually, man. let cool. me see what it does say on the inside. Oh, we can't show you the inside. Yeah. On the inside, it says Pulse Gene Chip. Pulse so, Gene Chip. I think Pulse 80 watt sounds better. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely Pulse 80 watt. So what we did is we took everything that people had given us feedback on on the mechanical one. Okay. And we changed the bottle a little bit, which I can't show you that right now, but you know. Can you we, tell us the material at least? Uh, the, the material is silicone. Same I mean, silicone. I, I can show you that it is silicone. This one's white. The final one will be black like that, but it's see-through enough that you can see it. Okay. Um, we made it, there's actually a cuff on the top of the bottle that makes it so you can actually hold on to that cuff instead of squeezing the bottle and juice coming out. He's telling secrets. You yeah. heard it first on Stan's show. <laughs> I don't know where it went. Well, if you've seen the uh, the Vandy Vape refill bottles, they're silicone, right. stainless steel tops. Yes. We're including a 30 mil bottle inside there. That's awesome. Oh, here it is. Thank there. you, sir. Because what I wanted to do is make sure that, you know, uh, people didn't have to take their bottle out to fill it. Yeah, no, that's fantastic little, man, that's awesome. So we that got a stainless that. steel cap on here, and then it also does have an insulator on oh, the 510. Oh, that's beautiful. To make sure that they don't short their mods up. That's a but great I, design. I'm still gonna tell you, if you're gonna use one of these things, don't turn, hit the button. Turn, turn the, the mod button. off. Right. You know? Right. Or if you have the, the, the mech version, unlock it, you know? So. We're all about good safety practices on yeah, the Nation CX. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. So, yeah, I mean, you know, I'm just stoked, man. You know, 80 watts, it's a single battery mod, yeah. It looks you know, gorgeous. It here, looks it, gorgeous. Here's one of the, the real keys to this thing, too, is that, okay, with the unregulated one, when somebody would say, what's the best 2700 battery, I'd say, well, Sanyo 2700A, but good luck finding one. Right. Right? Well, the 2700Bs are widely available. I've got a 2700B in here. It's got more uh, milliamp hours. And since it's regulated, it doesn't care if it's outputting, like... Chip has it rocking and rolling. Right. So, uh, 66 watts, 0.44 ohm build. Yesterday I went from 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. vaping hard on. What's the what's the resistance? Uh, the resistance uh, 0 0.44. Let's see a cloud, bro. Yeah. Oh, I, well, you know what? This one I don't have enough. Let's see. Oh, unfortunately. Oh, shoot. oh, 
He's out of juice. But wait, we'll try. Here, hold on. Look. Yeah, let's see it. That's a nice, that's a nice, dude, that's nice. Yeah. I can't wait to get a hold of one of these things. Check out this color. And it feels good what? in the hand, doesn't it? Yeah, it really yeah. does. It feels like that nice, uh, kind of like the, if you guys know about the drag from Vupu, it has like that same kind of resin feel that the drag does. And I've had people ask, is the resin from Vupu? I don't know. We're sourcing it from the outside. It may be. It might be the same manufacturer. Like the yeah. Mixa. So, you know, with the gene chip, that, you know, we, we're having to source that as well. So, you know, it. It, it's going to eat into the profits a little bit, but I thought it very important to put a chip in there that everybody knows good quality, is reliable, and does the things I won't do. I don't use temp control and all that stuff, but, right, right. but it'll do it. The second you take that stuff out is the second that everybody starts complaining yeah, about Oh, it doesn't have that. I'm like, but do you use it? Right, right, right. So, well, yeah. dude, I appreciate you taking yeah, the time man. with me, man, yeah. introducing us to the guys keep a lookout for this pulse 80 watt i'm telling you I'm, I'm i've held one i've seen it work the gene chip is fantastic right I, it, there's no way it can be bad but you know how it is we'll figure <laughs> it out whenever we get it all right right right, right. I found Mr. Grim Green. Check him out. What? It's Nick. Mr. Crazy. Grim Green, bro. Mr. I know, Grim right? Green. I just like was walking and I was like, boom, and yeah, and hard elbow. checked him. And, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, so, dude, this is so cool. Like Easy C and yeah. running into everybody yeah. and the people. What's your favorite part? I asked Ruby, but what's your favorite part of ECC so far? Uh, I, this particular ECC or just ECC in general? How about both? I have a lot of thoughts. Oh, Honestly, I really just like meeting people. That's my favorite part of anything. It's great to just come here and it, and it feels like a community. It feels like we're all on the same team. We have a common goal and it's just really great to meet people and I love it. I love it. Dude, I'm the same boat. The, the connections, I was telling her the connections and everything. That's yeah. my favorite part. It really it's energizes you, man. It really motivates you. Yeah. You know, when I get home on YouTube, I, I get, I'm proud of the vape community. You want to rock and roll. After coming here, you know? It's yep. great. What's uh, uh, What about this particular ECC? This particular ECC? Uh -oh. Well, I don't, I don't want to toot my own horn, but I really <laughs> love the way our booth turned out. Dude, your booth is it's the best the booth. Old, it's the first, like, really kind of pro-y booth that we've ever done. We've always done it, like, really DIY, really punk rock, but this year we're like, let's do it a good booth, and we did it. It's the only section of the show you can't actually walk through freely without hitting anybody. <laughs> right. It's completely packed it's the whole great. time. It's, it's been awesome. And why wouldn't it be? I mean, it, not to, oh, check this out. Boom, look what I got. Yeah. Look what I got. Hey, me too. Hey, this thing is way better than my other MePod. These are pretty and, banging. Yeah, I don't know if like it's because they changed the, um, changed the coils or what. I don't like, know what it is. Yeah, yeah, I have no idea, These are but good, though. it's fantastic. These are good, though. Um, and I got that Dreamer mech. Oh snap! What? He's, he's oh, oh Dreamer Mac, Dreamer Mac. That, what do you think about the black as opposed to all copper? Uh, I like looking at this much more. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look like what, what's your what's your term? A roll of shit covered pennies. Yeah, a roll of shit covered there pennies. There we go. There we go. That's yeah, what it that's is. That's how it goes. Yeah, Love the black. You guys know I like the shiny stuff, but guys like Nick that just don't like the polishing and everything. You know just, that black is. Sometimes I just get lazy and I want it to look good with little effort. <laughs> Everybody gets that way, man. It's like a champion. Very Every cool. Time. Very cool. Love it. Dude, I'm so stoked that you love it so much, man. Bro. It's awesome bro. to meet you guys. Yeah, bro. Um, there's nothing I can do to promote this, man. Like, yeah. I, oh, how about new, like, any new products or anything that you maybe can talk uh, about or well, anything happening you know, that you might want to do? There's, there's, a, a there's, a, there's a squonker coming out from Recoil. Uh, Dwayne designed it top to bottom. Uh, it's unbelievable. You kind of just have to wait and see it. It's regulated. It's got a rad bottle loading system, and that's going to be uh, soon. I'll give you that soon. I have held it very soon. I am very impressed. It's comfy. It's and so comfy in the hand, dude. Um, honestly, if it like, I'll spend the money. I'll spend the money. I I, I already know I'll spend the money. Good. And, and I don't I don't want to I want to like talk about details, but I know I can't. <laughs> So yeah, well we'll make sure you get one for a it's, review. It's I mean, yeah, very dope. Stan has to review it. Oh man, look, it's you heard be. it from the man himself. Look at that. Look <laughs> yeah. at that. That's badass. Yeah, dude. All right, dude. Well, thank you so much, Bro, man. Again, I'll you. shake your hand again. I'll shake this man's hand a hundred times. Yeah. Rock and roll. I'm sure I'll see you again. Yeah. Final day. Going home.
feel like I just discovered something amazing. Go, 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 go. He doesn't want to. What? Look, you can see me now. The sun is gone. Holy crap, I'm amazed. Thank you.